Hi, I'm Liam from Fowles and welcome to the Home Renovators Auction Preview for Wednesday the 25th of March 2020. Well, it's going to be a little bit different this week uh, in response to the coronavirus problem that's happening at the moment. Uh, we are not going to be having a live auction. We're going to be having an absentee only auction, uh, which will mean that uh, you won't be coming here to bid. Uh, you can put your absentee bids online or you can call your absentee bids up or email them in, whatever you like, but there won't be an actual live auction. Now, those absentee bids will need to be in by 11am, uh, so make sure you, uh, you check out the video and uh, look through the catalogue and get your absentee bids in. It is very easy to do absentee bidding. If you look on our homepage, you'll scroll halfway down our homepage and you'll be actually able to click on view items. You'll see the three auctions there and you'll be able to click view items and then you'll be able to absentee stri bid straight off there. Now at the end of this video, there's also a help video that goes for about two minutes and that'll play as soon as I've finished. Uh, you'll be able to watch that. That video is also available on our website. So a little bit different this week, but there's amazing stuff to have a look at. Uh, I'm going to spin around straight away and have a look at these beautiful mirrors. Uh, there's probably about, I reckon it's probably the first sort of 30 lots. Uh, these are pretty well unreserved. I reckon they're going to go around the smaller ones, probably 50 to 75. The large ones, look at the size, I'm absolutely huge. Probably between $1 and $200, maybe more. Just depends on who the highest bidder is. But there are some beautiful mirrors. Look at that, that is a sensational finish. The light wood frame mirror there, 1.2 by 1.5. Absolutely sensational, these mirrors. Uh, some some uh, stained wood ones, light wood. Uh, you've got these beautiful sort of gothic style, uh, those in the silver, also in the gold at the back. I'm saying that that'll be about, oh, two, it says 2.17 metres high at 125 wide. So a really big mirror, that one. Uh, lot 15's a nice one. It's that, that's a, in, just in the silver. Again, with that beautiful gilded frame, so a really nice look there. Uh, around the corner here, what else have we got? Some smaller ones there, uh, some uh, uh, various ones across the way through here as well, uh, all different styles. Uh, you are also able to, remember, have a look at these on the, on the website, so there'll be a photo of each one of those on the website that you can have a look at as well. Moving through now, I can see a heap of these uh, miscellaneous boxes of various bits and pieces. Um, uh, all different, uh, all different sort of homewares. Uh, I can see some digital TV antennas, more mirrors across the way, uh, a heap of ex-hire furniture through here. This is all pretty cool. This stuff. Uh, what else can I show you down the way? Uh, there's a Euro washing machine there, lot 85. Uh, let's look that up. Let's see what that sort of what sort of money that's looking to be getting there. Uh, lot 85. You'll be looking at probably around that 650 to 700 dollar mark, I imagine. It's probably similar with the fridge. That's a big fridge there, the 512 litre fridge uh, with a two year warranty. Probably around that 650 to 700 dollar mark as well. Uh, heaps and heaps of ovens in tomorrow. Um, you can call in and just see what sort of money you, uh, that, that we think that they'll be going for. For instance, lot 92, the Euro ovens, there's a heap of those. There's about 60 odd of those from memory. Uh, lot 92, let's see, I think they were, they were a couple of hundred bucks here. Lot 92, in at 450, I'm saying probably about for the 350 mark, I'll get those away tomorrow, so that, that's pretty nice buying. Uh, there's a, also a heap of ovens uh, down the way through, through the back here. Uh, 103, 104, these are combination microwaves, probably around that $250 mark. Uh, got the three month warranty on those as well. Uh, what else have we got? Heaps and heaps of taps. Uh, also, we've got uh, kitchen taps as well. More ovens, mountains of ovens. That's a beautiful one. That's the Belling Steam combination oven. That's pretty nice as well. Uh, probably around the 250 bucks. 250 bucks for a, a combination steam oven. Absolutely fantastic. Uh, heaps of these large ovens as well. These have been they've been sending these in a couple of weeks in a row now. That's uh, it's such the it's a 60 centimetre, but it's, it's it's a huge oven surface. From memory, it's about 80 litres. Uh, that's lot 161 and 162. Uh, you're looking there at around probably around I reckon 200 bucks a shot. There, we'll probably get those get get those get one of those to your house. Uh, really nice looking units. The Bowmatics as well, the Belling, so really good uh, European brands there. Uh, all a couple of hundred bucks on those ovens. So uh, if you need an oven tomorrow, it will be the day for you. Uh, also, heaps of dishwashers. There's uh, a load of these Omega uh, di dishwashers. These are a factory refurb. Uh, got heaps of them to go, and they have come with a, 
uh, usually a, a three month factory warranty, probably looking around 200 bucks a pop and there's heaps of them. But Amiga, really good brand, sister company to Schmeg. Heaps and heaps of these uh, barbecues, we've got the built in barbecues there, probably between sort of six and eight hundred dollars depending on the size uh, will be about the right bid on those. Uh, going through the back now there's a mountain of freestanding cookers, absolutely beautiful. Uh, depending on which which ones they are, the ninety the ninety centimeter ones you're probably looking between six hundred and a thousand on most of those will be about the right bids. Uh, and then we've got the smaller sizes, the six hundred mil and the five forties, probably a couple of hundred bucks on those. I'll probably be, you'd be dropping bids of two two to three hundred dollars should should see your way clear on those. They're really nice looking units. Some cooking packages here, again out of Euro, they've been popular, uh, sort of thirteen to fifteen hundred dollars from memory. Uh, uh, through here I can see a couple of wine fridges, uh, usually a couple of hundred dollars on those. You know, the bidding usually starts at about the $200 mark, finishes about that $250 mark, maybe up to $300. Uh, but they're great buying because they're usually sort of $700, $800 in the shops. A couple of these Fisher & Paykel integrated fridge, uh, French door fridges, uh, brand new, absolutely beautiful. Uh, they've still got the plastic wrapping on, of course, very, very nice. Uh, 5600 in the shops. I'm going to get them going for $2,000 tomorrow. Uh, and it looks like there's two or three of them. I can't see over the other side, but I think there's, I, I think there's might even be four of them. Uh, so dishwashers we've had a talk about, uh, there's a couple of nice bits and pieces through here, uh, we've got some shower screens at the back, uh, you're probably 400 to 450 on the shower screens there, uh, they're pretty nice as well. Uh, cooktops, there's a heap of these cooktops here, uh, gas cooktop. Uh, also induction cooktop and ceramic cooktop, uh, probably again a couple of hundred bucks on those. Uh, these, uh, these ones here, they're Italian made gas cooktops, uh, I'll get them going for 50 bucks a shot. So there's, there's a few of those left, uh, they'll be beautiful buying the, uh, the, the Italian cooktops at $50, so that's pretty nice. There's a, a, a damaged cooker here, this is lot 240, if someone's feeling handy uh, to fix that and source the parts, etc., I'll get that going for $1, so I reckon you, you might pick that up for 50 bucks, that'd be about the, be, be about the right money on that. Uh, what else can I see here? Uh, there's a nice looking uh, bed there, uh, that is a king size bed, uh, three, lot 370, let's have a look. Uh, I reckon 370, let's see. Just going to look it up for you now. Uh, yeah, king size bed from. Oh, look, I reckon it'd be probably about that three hundred dollar mark. But it's pretty nice. It's got the the, uh, the the shelves in the back there at the end. Uh, what else can I show you? Got some heaps of ovens, heaps of sinks as well. Uh, Frankie sinks generally sort of between sort of one and three hundred, just depending on. Uh, you can ring up for some guidance on those if you if you need to uh, find out a bit more about those. I got these sofas here. They're absolutely beautiful. There's a, a two seater and a three seater. Um, what lot number is it? It'll be over the other side, no doubt. Uh, it is lot number three sixty. Uh, I'm going to get them going for a thousand dollars a pair tomorrow. So you get a two seater and a three seater, and um, uh, in the shops, you know, four grand easy, and we'll get them going for a thousand dollars a throw. So that'll be good fun. I uh, got a couple of friends with those, and they absolutely love them. Uh, pizza ovens tomorrow, lot thirty nine. Uh, how many have I got of those? Looks like four. I'm going to get them going for two thousand dollars a shot. They are five thousand dollars in the in the in the stores. Uh, so two grand a piece tomorrow. Absolutely fantastic. I've got four of them. Uh, look, the stand is worth two thousand dollars. So uh, really nice buying. Okay, having a look through here now. We've uh, had these. In before these are these beautiful um, the uh, designer uh, face mask chairs so they are absolutely fantastic uh, look these are uh, in the shops they're around three and a half thousand dollars a shot uh, three and a half thousand dollars a shot now they bid around that four fifty five hundred dollar mark last time they were in and I'm expecting they'll probably go about the same way but as I said they yeah they're, they're three thousand dollars in the shop the, the retail on the description says 1944 and I know for a fact that's actually 1944 euro plus shipping so uh, it's amazing uh, this is pretty nice this is one of my favorites uh, the burgundy uh, the burgundy round chair X higher unreserved that'll be popular as well I'm guessing probably about uh, sort of 200 to 300 dollars on that would be about the right money uh, this TV here lot 430 it's a big one it is uh, how many inches it's 65 inch there is a line running through the screen uh, a fine faint line so it's unreserved and it will uh, oh look I'm, I'm guessing a good couple of hundred but dollars still uh, probably about uh, we'll start it away at a dollar it'll probably go to maybe uh, 200 250 somewhere around there I guess uh, we've got some of these uh, beautiful swing chairs 
these are in at $200 a shot, uh, and I think I've got maybe three or four, maybe, oh, it actually looks like I might have six of these. Very, very nice they are. Uh, a higher end model, uh, and at 200 bucks, they're an absolute steal. Uh, through here, have a look at these. These are gigantic. I'm going to sit in it so you can see how big it is. Uh, it's a big round table. It's got the Lazy Susan uh, on, on board as well. Uh, I reckon it comfortably seat, let's say, 10, maybe 12 people uh, in the three, the three sort of semi-circular um, uh, chairs. They, they're sort of loungy a bit as well, so um, you could probably, if you had a big space, you could sort of kick them back a bit after dinner, uh, but absolutely fantastic. Thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars worth in the shops. Uh, and what does it say there? Yeah, yeah, it's probably about three grand worth in the shops. I reckon probably about seven fifty, eight hundred dollars tomorrow. Absolutely fantastic. And there's a couple of them there. Lot four forty nine and lot four hundred and fifty. So uh, really, really nice gear there. Uh, there's some twelve seaters over there as well. Probably similar sort of money around that seven hundred and fifty dollar mark. Uh, so really nice outdoor gear tomorrow. Uh, very, very nice indeed. I'm really impressed by these pieces. They are. Uh, really cool. Uh, what else have we got in here to show you? I think I'm getting close to the end. Uh, some vanities. Uh, generally, the vanities sort of between 200 and about for the small ones, and about sort of 600 for the big ones. Uh, these have been really popular. I like these ones. Uh, they've got the it's the 1.5 meter wide. It's got the stone top. You're about sort of that $600 mark there. More mirrors out down this way. Uh, lots of more cooktops. There's some toilet suites there as well. You're probably looking, they're really beautiful back to the wall toilet suites. Uh, probably looking around that $200 mark there on the back to the wall toilet suites. These have been popular too, these 1.5 black gloss uh, vanities with the glass top. They wall, you wall mount them uh, around that $300 mark they've been going for. So I, I reckon that's an absolute bargain because they're about $1,100 in the shops. I've uh, got some range hoods there, they'll sort of be around that sort of $50 to $100 mark. Um, it's a really nice big auction this week. That probably just about covers it though. So uh, what's going to happen now at the end of this video, there'll be a brief two minute uh, rundown on how to use the absentee system as we won't be having a live auction tomorrow uh, due to the coronavirus, of course. Uh, so make sure you uh, watch the rest of this, uh, this video which will have the the instruction video on the end of it. Uh, get your bids in by 11 a.m. tomorrow. If you've got any questions whatsoever, call Megan on 9265 5504 or email us uh, into just through the website. That's the easiest way to get in, uh, get, get to us via email. Thanks for your, uh, your cooperation. We look forward to getting you a heap of bargains tomorrow. We'll uh, catch up with you then. Cheers.